this is Music Tech Help Guy, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to format a hard drive or flash drive on a Mac. Now, if you've been using Macs for a while, this may seem kind of simple, but uh, I get questions all the time from my students, how do I format my hard drive, or how do I format a flash drive on a Mac? Uh, so this video is geared towards people who are new to Macs. So I have my flash drive here, I have uh, three files here I need to get rid of. Now we could just drag and drop this down into the trash bin, uh, but actually formatting the flash drive rather than just deleting what's on it adds a certain level of protection, uh, security, and it generally will free up more space than simply deleting. So we're going to go into our applications folder, and then we're going to go down to utilities, and then we're looking for an application called disk utility. Here it is. In this app, uh, you'll see on the left side, you'll see our uh, Macintosh hard drive as well as our, as our flash drive. You'll also see two tabbed in icons. These are the partitions of the hard drive and of the flash drive. Uh, we're going to just create a new partition that has all 1.03 gigs of space. You don't necessarily have to have a partition with, um, say, two halves. Uh, you don't have to split the hard drive or the flash drive in half. Uh, so from here, we're going to go to our Erase tab, and in here we have a format and a name. I'm going to drag over this and name it USB Drive, give it a new name, and then pick a format. Uh, for Mac, pick one of the OS formats, and then if you want this to also be compatible on a PC, choose the MS-DOS format. You'll find that some hard drives are not compatible with both. Uh, Mac and PC, or they claim to be compatible with Mac and PC, but maybe it doesn't show up on your PC, but shows up in your Mac. Try formatting it with your MS-DOS uh, format here. If that doesn't work, we can choose one of our four secure erase options here. So we have don't erase, zero out, seven pass, and 35 pass. These just add an extra level of security to our erase. Now the seven pass and 35 pass erase are both high security options. Uh, it goes through, erases all the data. I would recommend doing this if you are planning on selling a hard drive back. Now, don't erase data is our standard format. Um, it doesn't add a whole lot of uh, extra security, um, so I'd only do this if you want a quick format and you don't need to sell this back to someone. What you can do if you're having that issue of, of your uh, drive working on a PC as well as a Mac is try the zero out data first. Um, sometimes it'll erase some of the formatting that makes the hard drive only compatible with Mac uh, and can make it work on both. Uh, but keep in mind that a standard one terabyte hard drive is going to take about four to five hours to format with this option, and even more for the seven pass and for the 35 pass erase. So we're just going to do the standard uh, format. So we're going to click Don't Erase, OK, and then we're going to click Erase. Now I can't actually do a live uh, erase uh, during a screen capture because for whatever reason QuickTime 10 screen capture doesn't let me do that. It gives me an error. Um, so you'll just have to trust me on that one. So if you have any uh, questions or comments, uh, I know I went a little quick this time, uh, leave them in the comments section below. Thanks.